Serving Southern New Mexico, this is the award-winning KRWG-TV News 22, where news matters. A senior guard on the NMSU women's basketball team has great aim at the basket. News 22's Kristen Machetta tells us Brooke Salas grew up with the basketball in her hands. Brooke Salas was only six years old when she first picked up a basketball. She is originally from Placentia, California, where she led her high school basketball team to their best run in school history. Dad taught me everything I knew about basketball. He made me get up Saturday mornings at 8 a.m. when I was in elementary school, even when I didn't want to, to do ball handling and stuff. So he's a big part of the reason why I'm the player I am today. And in high school, she averaged 17.5 points per game. And now as an Aggie, she is averaging 18.9. Even though her performance has been outstanding, the transition has been challenging. The speed of the game, the physicality of the game, um, you're expected, a lot more is expected from you at the next level, and so that was an adjustment. During the games, Brooke has not gone unnoticed by Aggie fans. She puts time in the gym and um, just hard work every day. I mean, it's any player that's good has gotten there for hours and hours of practicing, just um, improving their game in the little things. So. Brooke is a leader, and she's a very good basketball player. Very, very good. She's currently in fourth place on the New Mexico State all-time scoring list and is on pace to finish her college career in second. I don't play for statistics. I play to win, but still, that's pretty cool. Brooke is looking forward to the WAC tournament in Las Vegas in March. If they win, it would be their fourth championship. After college, she hopes to play professionally, but whatever comes next, she's made a mark in the Pan Am. And she having a good year. I think she's a future Hall of Famer for New Mexico State, so I think she's absolutely great. Kristen Mistretta, News 22. Serving Southern New Mexico, this is the award-winning KRWG-TV News 22, where news matters.